Welcome back from Graphic Extras. In this tutorial, I'm just going to quickly show you how to use gradients to create line designs for patterns. Now, just going to go to Photoshop using CC, but same approach for other applications, obviously. And just going to go to the gradient tool. I've got a gradient here, one of the gradients from the Graphic Extras gradients collection. It's one of the color crunch set. And I've set it to the mirrored option mirror reflected so I'm just going to start in the center I'm going to hold the shift key down so it's basically a straight lines and I'm just going to go right to the end point just there and now you've got this design there's straight lines that matches top to bottom obviously the sides don't particularly match but it actually ends in black and black there so they do match so now edit define pattern Click OK. And of course you can create your own uh, gradients if you wish. It's very simple. The gradient is just a line and just basically created using various alternating black and then coloured stops. Now define pattern and once you've done that you can then just go to layer new fill layer pattern just to see the actual pattern now you can actually just see it just by dragging it across and dragging around straight lines that can be any position you can actually stop there of course you can combine them if you wish as well you can actually create multiple layers and well, I'll just show you that as well layer duplicate layer and now put that to say difference just up a bit I can't see difference and of course that's and then you can just shift it slightly and you can actually see and again these are all straight lines it's a straight line pattern that can be used multiple times anyway hope you found this quick tutorial of interest and that you'll subscribe to the graphic extras channel and that you'll go and check out the graphicextras.com website where there's lots of tutorials as well as lots of uh, things like gradients and others. Thank you much.